I'm not mad though, but I'm gonna do the opposite of what you did. I'm gonna find kids and make sure they're okay. I love you, I forgive you, but don't, you don't need to come home anymore, Colonel. In his defense, milk is sometimes really hard to find. It takes 20 years sometimes. Daddy, if you read this, I am now staying in the bell tower in the church. I have cereal and games and sleeping bag for both of us. I'll be waiting. Love you, Colonel. Miss you, Dad. Dear Dad. I I wrote you a letter last month and Delbert asked me to write you another letter. He said it will find you. I just want to say that I'm doing okay. Everybody's taking care of me. I miss you. Guest book. It's in, it's in H's hand now, Delbert. I know my dad and brother are okay. So everyone the, I just hope everyone's, everyone's okay in the vaults. Door closed, another that opens. Don't need to grieve because nobody really died. They're just different now. I didn't lose anything in the war, in fact. Grieving is not a product by Lucas. What a weird... Like It's like a funeral hall for the people that were left outside of the vault. Unfortunately, I already forgot them. I don't, can't remember his, their names. Oh, I missed the lore. That's right, there was another lore. Dealing with survivor's guilt. Step one, learning how to forgive yourself. This can take a long time, in fact. It can take a lifetime. You survive something tragic, and that's tragic and that's difficult for anybody. It's up to you, find someone to talk to. Worth it. Beef. Hey there, buddy. No, come here. I need your beef. Thank you. I need the beef to eat. It's a matter of survival. That was a very brutal kill, though. That took a long time. Hello there. Flatwoods. Overseer's Log, town of Flatwoods. My god. There's no one here. The old tavern, the church. People were using them for shelter, but they're gone. Mutations we expected. There's something else. Ooh. A disease. I was attacked by... Well, well it used to be a here. person. Why not grab but it had these green back. glowing or lesions good. and its voice. Angry. Tortured. We are one. One what? Whatever happened here is beyond anything we expected. And we expected a lot. Before they were wiped out, the survivors called themselves the Responders. Looks like they were made of firefighters, police, emergency medical staff. They even have an automated system to teach people about treating water, food, survival. I'm doing their tests, and you should too. I know it's even worse than we imagined, but... Someone's got to know where the missile silos are, and how to secure them. The responders are the best lead we have. This is the Overseer, signing off. Uh, when you boot up the game, it's going to tell you, um, the game's not unlocked yet. You'll have to wait until launch day, and just give it about 30 seconds, Hi. and then it unlocks. Dasa asked me if I would talk about, um... How I got here. She asked everybody, so I, I said okay. My, name, my name's Colonel. Just let it sit open for about 30 seconds and it unlocks. I, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. I'm sorry for everything. Um, the bombs and the messed up people and the house with two heads and all of it. I was bad. Just 
bad. I, I cheated on my spelling test. <gasps> I, I kicked Chip Wilkins in the shins until he cried. I pushed Rosie McCloy down the stairs. Um, I, I cut holes in the bottom of all the gym shorts and I put glue in the mashed potatoes in the cafeteria. I told Harold Newell to eat 10 dead flies a day in order to grow muscles and <gasps> I put new Coca-Cola in the rat cage water bottles at the pet store. And, um, I just wanted to say I'm sorry about everything. We call it the Great War. Now. Whoops. It's not been long. Things have Most been of these people's stories are kind of like, eh. Welcome to Survivor Stories. You're dead now. I'm Dasa Ben Ami, a responder. I've been working with the responders for a couple of years now. I'm from Charleston originally. I'm sorry, I ruined it. Join up. What wasn't easy was the work. Rebuilding Appalachia from the rubble while survivors Some of these to us regularly things are really time. long. So many have come and gone. Their stories untold. Their names lost to time. I thought we should preserve this history somehow. I've decided to ask people to record their thoughts, their stories, anything they want to preserve forever. I'll call Why? these stories the survivor stories. I'll start with me. I was an anthropology PhD student at Vault Tech University. Final year. I was printing my thesis when I heard the sirens. I thought for sure my father, a Vault Tech employee, could take us all with him, but only two reservations came through. I refused to go. My little brother, he went to the vault. They could not persuade me, though they tried. In the end, I pushed them inside it, and that was it. After that, I, I went back home to Charleston and, well, survived. Eventually, the responders formed, and I, I signed up right away. It was so hard. The flood was devastating. Relocating to Morgantown Airport and now Flatwoods has been... I remain optimistic. Been with them now for, uh, oh, I guess two years. We have big plans. We can do so much to help. Maybe. I'm afraid if I lose this, I'm gonna start playing. We can rebuild enough to be okay. And in the meantime, I will continue to record stories of survivors when I can. We are your history. Been on me, off for now. I can see I can see all those goodies in there. I want them. Zero skill, I know. Kitchen terminal. Uh, volunteer training program food. Let's check that. All right, let's go uh, do the main mission. All right, let's see. Register here. Transferring course to external hardware. Report to responder Kesha McDermott for further instruction. Wait, Kesha? Like glamorous Kesha? Kesha McDermott. Uh, monitoring water safety programs in Flatwood. Connecting ongoing hydrology experiment. Glamorous. Yeah, I think it's Kesha Kesha. I'd imagine, like, if in the wasteland, somehow she would still look fabulous and have all these servants just bringing her stuff. Because she's glamorous. Alright, where is her body? I think I might have to track it. Get the supply drop. Search for Kesha along nearby the river. Oh, she's right. Literally 10 feet in front of me. Water testing kit. Kesha McDermott survivor story. Dasa has asked us all 
to document our stories for posterity, you know. Seems like a fine idea. So, hi, I am Kesha McDermott. Hello, Kesha. When the bombs fell, I was in Watoka, coordinating a statewide science fair for that year's high school kids. And the theme was Test the sample from the pumps. of energy. After the bombs, everything was pretty chaotic. Scavenging for food and fighting off rabid survivors. Oh, it was just a bad time all around. I found a couple of surviving kids from the high school whose parents didn't make it. And we hold them in a house in Thank town you. for a while. After a bit, I need the leather. I was able Sorry. to solder the circuitry in an old radio and we tuned in to a broadcast from the response. New subscriber. Oh, we were overjoyed. The trip from Watoka to Flatwoods. It was rough, mind you. The kids and I ran into a group of assholes <gasps> in the mountains who stole our food and water. I can't tell you how happy I was to find the responders in Flatwood. Tents for everyone, open kitchens, medical supplies, protection. <laughs> we were safe. They had a problem, though. Their water sources were contaminated heavily. People were boiling water, but not long enough to make it safe. So, I stepped up and I said, I'll build a testing kit to monitor the contamination and I will teach folks how to properly boil water. <laughs> and I did. The world is getting better, but slowly. We need to make sure it doesn't relapse too. It's going to take time and care, that's all. Well, time, care, and science. Is it just me or does she sound like a young woman trying to sound old? It doesn't come off as believable, I guess. I don't know. Like, she sounds like she's trying to sound old, but she's not really old. It comes across that way a little bit. So far, most of the survivor stories are like... Mm, okay. Okay. Nothing too crazy. Or exciting. Yeah, it's like, oh, well, that's cool. I like the other bits of lore, and I like the radio program. That was cool. I want to find another part of the radio program. We got part one. I want part two now. I'll be going in there in a minute. Uh, why is everyone freshly dead? Oh, part two! Tonight, we bring you the final chapter of Who Goes There? The Strange Encounter in Flatwoods. In the last episode, pioneer scout Brett Fisher met a curious girl named Sally while hiding in the dark. But as it turned out, they weren't alone. There are other people here? Yeah, they probably just went to get more food. They'll be back soon enough. You can wait with me, and they'll give you food too. You just have to do what they want. What do you mean? When they want to play games with you. Games? What kind of games? I'm still learning the rules. Mostly, they're kind of boring, and only hurt when they use the needles. Needles? Wait, what? What happened? It like stop playing. Don't worry, don't worry. I got you. I got, I got you guys. I got you. Don't worry. I got you. Thanks for subbing, Kinsian, and the one cop, Red Herring, Hello Cool, Fred Carl, Quilt Strike, Scuffman, Maestro King, Black Sparrow. Thank you guys. It was part two.
That's just a raider. Don't worry. I don't have to worry about him. He's just a raider. Wait a minute. It's not playing, is it? There it goes. I got it. We're good. Tonight, we bring you the final chapter of Who Goes There? The Strange Encounter in Flat Woods. In the last episode, yeah, the footsteps on peep players is really loud. A curious girl named Sally while hiding in the dark. But as it turned out, they weren't alone. <sighs> They want to play Stay little play. games Stay with play. the kids? Okay, okay, stop screaming. What the hell? Ah, the light. It's so bright. That's where they come in to bring food when it's time to play. <gasps> Sally, what's that helmet thing you're wearing? It looks like it's screwed into your head. took a like a crazy turn all of a sudden and I was like oh this is this is interesting they're just playing oh what? okay that great great how can people play already um PC is actually unlocked early it's not supposed to be but it is you have the game on PC just boot it up it's gonna be like you can't play until launch day and just give it about 20 30 seconds and then it goes Welcome, it's launch day! And you're like, yay! New subscriber! Bob the Maniac, thank you for the Prime sub. Thank you very much. Alright, let's go turn in this stuff over here. <laughs> and I don't know why, but it seems like anyone that's also subbed with Twitch Prime or normal sub gets unlocked faster. I, I, can't, I can't tell if that's like provable, but there seems to be some correlation there. I don't know like what's going on. Seems like there's some sort of like connection. So I would just sub just to be safe, just, you know, just to make sure. New subscriber. Oh, thank you for subbing Pokemaniac. Thank you very much. Enjoy Fallout 76. <laughs> Thank you, uh, Cheesy uh, Sloth, for subbing as well. New subscriber. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, 
Uh... Rank four. New subscriber. Uh, sending was data to responder. Cache is terminal for analysis done. Complete one more experiment for the responder to become full volunteer. Transferring course to external hardware. New subscriber. Thank you, Sammy Dubs, and Agro Paul and Dr. Robinson. You guys are awesome. And thank you, uh, Cheesy Sloth. Thanks for the subs, guys. You guys are wonderful. Thank you. Find Delbert Winters in Flatwood. New subscriber. Black Dragon, thank you for subbing. Winston Moriarty, thank you for the sub. Level up. New subscriber. Give me that gum. New subscriber. Your pipe weapons break more slowly and are cheaper to repair. Your kid's so ugly, the cat tries to cover him up in the sandbox. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, I wasn't expecting to get wrecked. Holy crap. Ouch. That burns. Damn. My god. Uh, I need lock picking. Lock picking. Hmm. It's agility, right? But I don't think it's available yet. Is it perception? I think next level it, it'll show. I'm going to... I can start hacking. I definitely want hacking for now. So I can get into it everywhere. Falling below 20% health, well, automatic uses stim packs once every 20 seconds. Yeah. You had me at hacking. Did they patch in a FOV slider? No. Nope. They say that it like breaks the game or animations or something by having FOV high, but I never noticed any of that when I had the FOV high. So I don't know like where they're getting that from, but that's their reason for not having it in. You used to be able to play uh, with high field of view in the beta, but then they passed it out, which was weird. Reverend Delbert Winters here, born and raised in this very town. Met my own church to the responders for their outpost here, and uh, you're welcome. The responders are on a true mission, you see, helping folks through thick and thin. Can you edit it now? The heavens open up again and take us all up anyways. When this all happened, I figured like most, it was time. Hmm. This was the end, but, but it wasn't, was it? We're still here. At first, I thought it was a mistake, that we was missed, forgotten. Maybe we did some wrongs. Didn't give enough to charity, maybe. Didn't praise his name, even in the worst of times. Maybe thought some things that ought not to have been thought. So I asked him, I asked how, why? I fought your wars on earth. I'm ready to fight them up there by your side. Then in my despair, I saw some survivors eating raw rat carcass. Oh, I need, I need water. I'll try the editing the iron to see if it works. That first, I warned them. It seemed obvious. We tried, but got sick. They said covered in their own filth. I realized right then and there that I would be in task. From then on, I built kitchens, cooked good food, fed anyone who walked up with an empty belly, 
and I was thankful for my task in life. Thankful. <laughs> Next time hell or high water land in my stoop, I'll be New swept subscriber. clear away with it. But until then, let's share a home cooked meal together. All right. All right, partner. All right, I, I will try the I and I tweak to see if it works. We'll see. If this works, oh thank God, I, I will be very happy. All right, let's see if it works. My games Fallout seventy six. It should be the same Fallout for Field of View I and I. Display. Okay, so I'll need to do a uh, text document dot i nine Fallout seventy six. Was it custom? Fallout, Fallout seventy six custom. Let's go 85, 85. That needs to be also display. I'm in. I think that is all I need. See, just then it goes boop. I don't know. This picture is says level one. I don't. I don't know. I'm not level one. It did save. New subscriber. At least it better have. I think it's just a photo. Thank you for subbing, Onyx. Wait a minute. All responders. The field of view is better. Mr. Phone hands are out of control. Evacuate civilians and take down those supervisors. Once they're dealt with, you'll have to reboot the server. It worked. Again. It worked. Oh. Oh. New subscriber. <laughs> Nothing's broken either. No, no issues are. In Fallout 4, you could, like, make it move up. But it looks like they removed that. You can't do that anymore in this game. So the only problem is the, uh... The thing is kind of like that. And you can't do the fix in Fallout 4, where you would...
I can do this instead, which works, but that's the, uh... It's fine. Like, I can do this mode, which, which is basically the uh, UI for, uh, the suit. But, I don't like that. It's fine. It's just, it'll be a little tiny is all. It's better to have wide field of view, though. Versus worrying about that. In Fallout 4, um, you could click on the, uh, the thing and it would, like, zoom in and be normal. But, they, who said they removed that for 76? Oh well. But it looks like they replaced the ability to zoom in with the uh, UI for the uh, the suits. What V does is it, it alternates between this and this. This is what V does. And also right click does that as well. It used to like zoom in but to bring your arm closer but they got rid of that. All right, I need me some meat. Ribeye steak. Awesome opossum bacon. I'm all about that. my training a happy day on the bar let's see yep it's multiplayer Just a bugged NPC. Oh, if, if you block someone, does that make them go away? Or disappear from your server? Or not? I'm not sure if that's a thing. Would be nice. Looks like it's uh, saving the FOV through lows, which is good. Automated warning to all responders. The Mr. Fan hands are out of control. Evacuate civilians and take down those supervisors. Indeed. Once they're with, you'll have to reboot the server again. All right. I am a volunteer. A large horde of Scorch is on the move and might be headed for our main base at Morgan Airport. All personnel will request to port the HQ in, in, as soon as possible. Bring weapons and medical supplies. Maria Chavez. Connection terminated. Welcome. Welcome, responders, volunteer. Thanks for working with us. As you know, we are trying to cope with the influx of survivors uh, that need our help. The new volunteer program is going to help us concentrate on medical help while volunteers focus on basic survival needs. We're also collecting data for the responders database, which will help us rebuild Appalachia one day. So please keep your data when you can. Looks like we are good. Did I complete that one quest? Looks like we did. So now we need to investigate the airport. And we leveled to five. Oh, 
let's see. Lock picking, yes, please. I'm gonna go grab this over here. Uh, yeah, there is a currently an event going on. It says kill farmhand supervisors. It's on. I like the perk card system. I, th I find it fun. I don't know if it's just me, but I do find it fun. Yeah, something about it's charming, and I like it. I don't know. I enjoy it. Where are these farmhand supervisors? Further up the hill? They're looking for the supervisors. It's like an event. Maybe over this way. Get all that too. Uh, pacifist mode means that I can't harm other players accidentally. And they can't harm. Uh, they can't harm me. But very slowly. Very very slowly. Over encumbered, I need to drop off stuff. I don't know where. Oh, did someone kill it? Change farmhand targeting parameters. Whoops. Stop moving. Okay, I need to... I need to, like, drop... I have too much stuff. I need to make a stash somewhere and put things inside of it. Actually, here's a bench. Oh, s someone put their shit here. I will put all my stuff in there, too. That helps. <laughs> Wooden chess piece. Huh? I know it's the mother load. I will. Oh wait, there's no take all button. Oh no, why would they get rid of the take all button? Taking it out so I can scrap all the stuff. Because you can't scrap it once it's in your stash, which is annoying. Now I'm storing it, because it weighs less if you scrap it beforehand. Because you have a weight limit on your stash of 400 pounds. 
I know it sounds stupid, but that's how it works. I need to use these plants too that are my inventory. Oh, did they finish the event? I think they must have. Went away for me. Actually, there, I still have a quest mark that says search this area. Alright, let's see what's inside. Overseer's Journal. because I used to come to this same farm when I was a kid. <sighs> I remember at the autumn festival, me running through the corn maze, going every which way, mom and dad yelling after me to slow down. <laughs> Wasn't gonna happen. I guess I was always hitting my fast. Couldn't just be a pioneer scout. I had to make troop leader. Couldn't just be a good student. I had to have straight A's. God, I miss those early days. She's bragging now. Being a kid, the three of us, our simple life, our simple house. I wonder if it's still standing. Remind me of, she reminds me of like Hermione from Harry Potter. Yeah, like I'm like really awesome. You should, like, totally be jealous of me. I, like, achieved so much. Note to Mac. Mac, we need you. The Scorch was seen over by Tillis Farm. They're staying with us now. But it's only us and the children. All the men are at Morgantown. We haven't been heard from them in weeks. You've been away for so long. Working on these damn bots. Come home, love, Marjorie. All right. Actually, I can't take that. Vault Tech Facility Orientation. Data corrupted. Malore! Mr. Farmhand's programming. Locked. Admin override core farmhand settings. Okay, I guess the people before me already did this dungeon. Which is fine. That means I can't have fun though. They got they did all the fun before me. Fine. Random gnome. At least the loot's still here. Snap read. New subscriber. Saturn, thank you for the sub. Compost. Command, supervisor assignments, crops must grow, ammo, 
Steal from. Requires terminal. Hmm. Buddha fruit, dinner fork. Don't forget to use your perk and do an extra search on med containers. Oh, wait, do I have to loot it twice? Flower pot. Gunpowder. Antiseptic. That's a weird looking plant. Fire cap. Oh, I have to like search it to activate it. Okay. Alright, well, we'll try. Toxic water. I don't want that. You like my stream? Well, thank you. I think there was an upstairs, too. New subscriber. The ladies' room. I can't go in there. Not allowed. Thank you for subbing, Fabio. Let's see what's upstairs. Oh, it does work. <gasps> So I just had to have to search them twice to get extra loot. Interesting. I hear what sounds like a player walking. There they are. Okay, I was like, I'm not going crazy, right? Keep hearing footsteps. That, that's just a, a, a raider that's messed up. <gasps> intelligence bobblehead. Plus two intelligence for one hour. Well, I have 200 IQ. Now, bobbleheads. Bobbleheads are no longer an item that you collect. They are consumables now. Which makes me go... Okay... Marge, I miss you and the boys more than life. Don't think I'm a coward. I'm using what God gave me to help the only way I can. That Crouch Center is a chance to feed all the people. I'll get it done. I'm close. I can feel it. McFadden. Cigarettes. Four three ninety three. Facilities all busted. Tried we started the generator, but fusion core spent. Everybody's soul is busy fighting, not growing crops. People need this. Respiners came through with the fusion core, plugged it in, whole place lit up. What a sight! But all the farmhands are hunks of metal. <sighs> Heard we lost a battle near Grafton get to uh gotta get the farming up before it's too late people are starving out there got one farm handle line all the vt terminals were fried had to figure it all out on my own success the whole fleet of farm hands are up but they won't move just got the focus circuits back in line Keep complaining about fertilizer just plant the seeds and you go to all is better than nothing got into uh, running the central movie thing to, for the farm hands running out of options i'm not a robot tech so doing my best haven't heard from anybody, not even Marge, but if anyone's out there, they'll need food. It's got access to the co- Get out of here! Maybe if I set it to zero, they'll start planting.
wooden block, plastic plate. New subscriber. Thank you for subbing, awesome fossil. My mic's on. <laughs> I don't have a mic hooked to this computer, so. If they heard me, it was telepathically, not physically. One kind of one kind of bug I notice is that it's showing my first character I made, even though I'm not on that character anymore. It's like... This is the character I made before it saved. I, I had to remake a character, and I took the picture without put posing for it. Although I didn't take the picture, so maybe I think it's using the screenshot. Oh, it shows all pictures I took. <gasps> we need to take photos for memories. Are there photo spots around this area? Because we need to make a photo album. What's the button for um, photo mode? in the menu. Photo mode. Oh. Let's well, cut more clicks than I would like, but there you go. Can I turn off the depth of field? Is it depth of field's really bad in this? break down my stuff before I store it. Now, sometimes the things that an item breaks down into is weighs less than this item itself. It's always like... Because of the weight limit. You didn't have to worry about that in, the ba in Fallout 4, but... This one with the weight limit, you kind of do. Okay, scrap all scrap. Transfer. Hold on. Hmm. Would I like free atom points? Yes, yes, I would. Okay, I haven't really checked out the Adam store. I don't know what's like in there. All right, so let, how do you find that? All right, so map. Adam, atomic shop. Vampire costume, RR jump, sweatered slack.
So it's all cosmetic stuff. Like instead of a dirty generator, it's just a clean one. And I noticed that I'm earning these for free by doing the challenges. I don't know how long that will last though. Yeah, so as, as I'm doing these challenges, I'm earning free uh, of the currency. Harvest 12 different herbs. Reach level 6. Take photos near Vault 50, 70, uh, 76. Trade with a player. Harvest firecracker. Claim different workshops. Workshops. Oh, I need to heal. Uh, there. Oh, let me break down my other stuff real fast. Scrap. It's an upgrade, but if I break it down, I unlock the stuff. One thing I noticed is if you break down good gear, it's, you tend to unlock mods for other weapons and stuff, which is good. So all these weapons actually become useful. You in Fallout 4, you just sort of like start with all these mods, but you have to earn them in this game. Find the next journal in Sutton. All right, I guess we'll head over to this. I don't know what that is. Oh, Overseer's Journal. I guess we'll head that way. Well, it makes sense that you can't swap mods because they want you to constantly be consuming the endless resources out in the environment. If you could just re if there could be a finite amount of mods out there, then you would start stockpiling so much scrap and have nothing to spend it on. Yeah, well, you know, I know a lot of people hate cosmetic stuff, but it makes the developers so much money and allows them to keep making games. New subscriber. As long as the cosmetic stuff doesn't affect gameplay, I don't mind them being in the in the uh, in the there being like a cosmetic shop. As long as it's purely cosmetic. Like, PoE is a good example of a game where the gameplay is unaffected by cosmetic purchases at all. Except for a stash, other than that. That's the way to do it correctly. So, so whales can spend much, a lot of money to look as fancy as they want. But as long as I don't have to, like, suffer from not buying something, that's when it starts getting iffy. And to be fair, PoE is free to play. That's true. That's a very fair point. This game is a full play to game. Full, full play game. Oh, Red X. To be fair, yes, it is free to play. Come here, Doc. Thank you. I will need to make a base soon. that looks like a bunch of log cabins or something over here there's a I see a sky bridge over here Oop, more first aid This is cool. Oh, shit. It's like an Ewok area. 